You know, look at this right here. You think these are pictures, but they're actually moving in the picture. Wow, look at this right here. Who's talking? Hold on, so let me see this. Look at this right here. In Philadelphia, African American Museum. When I was nine to six, I went blind. But the good Lord, He gave me back my eyesight when I was a hundred and two. As the Bible read to me near every day. And I rides my mule, Henry, down to Christ Church in Philadelphia every Sunday and back. I see wow. it all. I see it from the beginning. No, go to somebody else. Go to somebody else. Go to somebody else. Somebody, if you, Sue, who, what names are these? Wow, you got to press the button on them and they'll talk. Let's see this dude right here. Yeah, I wasn't always an artist. No, indeed. But trade was barbary. I learned it from my father. And while I didn't like it much, I was good at it. So good that I cut hair up and down this America. Mostly aboard First barber. steamers. And it was a good life. I learned a lot about this country of ours. I learned quickly that to have a face, the color of mine, is not to my advantage. No, sir. Some cities had laws about what our kind could or could not do. The same as Philadelphia. Get the Jasmine God girl. But after more this. so after this. the deeper you got down south. I learned to stay aboard the boat when we pulled into river towns like New Orleans, St. Louis, and even Cincinnati. Let's go look at this other girl. Wow, this is crazy right here. This is dope. I have a natural gift for music. My friends tell me that I have a lovely singing voice and perfect pitch, whatever that is. <laughs> I sing without accompaniment as I do not have a piano forte or anyone to play for me on that instrument. <laughs> in 1820, when I was but one year old, my mistress, Mrs. Elizabeth Greenfield, moved me and crazy. a few remaining slaves to Philadelphia, where it. she joined the Society of Friends cool. and promptly thereafter cool. freed us all. <laughs> and now that I am older, I have returned. It's called an epilogue. Even though I am a person, is she Wow. This is like that. Still. You, you, you ever see the movie Time Machine? If you see the movie Time Machine, they're mimicking it exactly. Well, you just bought a hot tub time machine. Huh? 